NXL ALL Maths, Pure Paper 1, October 2021, Question 2. Given that f of x equals x squared minus 4x plus 5, we need to express f of x in the form x plus a squared plus b, where a and b are integers to be found. So this is completing the square. So we've got our f of x. We're now going to try and convert this into this format here, where I've left the plus 5 on the end. I've put the square brackets in. And what we're going to try and do is create a completed square form, which equals x squared minus 4x. So in the bracket with the x there, to get minus 4x, we're going to need a minus 2 in there. So you think if you were to expand these brackets, we would get two lots of minus 2x. This would give us the minus 4x. However, if we expanded x minus 2 all squared, we'd also get minus 2 times minus 2, which is a positive 4, which we don't want. So we're going to take it away again. Okay. So, so far, we've got the square brackets, which if we expanded would equal x squared minus 4x. And we've still got the plus 5 on the end, as we had to start with. Now we can simplify this by bringing the minus 4 and the plus 5 together. So we get x minus 2 all squared plus 1. Now the curve of equation y equals f of x meets the y-axis at the point p and has a minimum turning point at the point q. So for part b, we need to first write down the coordinates of p. So it's meeting the y-axis at this point. So we know that x is equal to 0. So we're going to do f of x, f of 0 is equal to 5. So the coordinates are 0, 5. For part 2, we need to find the coordinates of q. So this is the minimum turning point. So if we look at our f of x in our completing the square form, we've got x minus 2 all squared plus 1. As x minus 2 all squared has to be larger than or equal to 0, the minimum of this is going to be when x minus 2 is equal to 0. So x is equal to 2. And if we put that into x minus 2 all squared plus 1, we get a value for y of 1. So we've got a coordinate 2, 1. If you've enjoyed this video, remember to subscribe to the Doing Maths channel to keep up to date with all the latest releases.